Dry eye syndrome is a condition caused by changes in the quantity or quality of your tears. The tear film comprises three layers. The outer lipid layer includes components like cholesterols, fatty acids and phospholipids. Some components serve to increase lubricity and prevent evaporation, while other polar lipids can join with some of the mucins to create greater cohesivity of the tear film. The middle aqueous layer contains numerous essential nutrients supportive of the ocular surface environment. It is water-based and includes components such as lysozyme, immunoglobulins, sodium and some soluble mucins. The mucin layer components include silicic acid, hyaluronic acid and mucins such as MUC 1, 2, 4, 16 and 5AC. Some mucins form a cushioning viscoelastic matrix that both protects the ocular surface and provides the even surface necessary for good vision. Whilst other mucins function in a glue-like fashion, securing the tear layer to the microvilli and glycocalyx. The blink mechanism is when the upper lid sweeps down and the lower lid rises to meet it. Lids sweep debris away and push the tear layer like a tidal wave. The tear layer compresses to a fraction of its former thickness, absorbing the energy of the blink and replenishing itself evenly across the corneal surface. Within milliseconds of the lid's passage, the tear layer reforms in both structure and function the energy of the blink harmlessly dissipated. If tears break up too quickly, the mucins no longer function adequately to sustain tear layer cohesion and surface protection. This may be observed clinically as areas of rapid fluorescein breakup. As the tear film breaks up, the lipid and aqueous layers dry up, causing the mucin layer to diffuse away, leaving the ocular surface bare and exposed. This enables an inflammatory cascade and sometimes irreversible damage occurs. The patient becomes increasingly symptomatic and often experiences visual disturbance. In treating ocular surface disease, a therapy that allows the ocular environment to return to normal is the first step. The intelligent delivery system of Cystane Ultra, consisting of HP Gua, borate and sorbitol enables the ingredients polyethylene glycol and propylene glycol to lubricate and provide protection. As this intelligent delivery system interacts with the tear film, the pH adjusts to the natural pH of the eye, optimizing the viscosity of the solution. This allows for a comfortable installation by improved spreading of the drop over the ocular surface with less blur which then becomes more elastic and structured as it interacts with the now hydrophobic areas of damaged cornea. After the initial coating forms, Cystane Ultra Lubricant Eye Drops interact with divalent ions in the tear film, releasing the sorbitol and allowing stronger cross-linking between borate and HP Gua. The result is a tightly structured protective matrix over damaged areas of the ocular surface. HP Gua does not affect the shear properties of the fluid, which remain low to aid the eyelid blink mechanism. However, the tensile strength of the HP Gua and borate bond increases, which helps reduce tear film breakup. HP Gua and borate bind to areas on the cornea that lack normal architecture. The HP Gua matrix that forms serves as a bandage, which promotes healing of the disrupted ocular surface and may eventually lead to a return to normalcy for the tear layer. By working with the tear film chemistry and eyelid mechanics, this highly structured protective matrix provides retention of the demulcents to allow for long-lasting lubrication and surface protection.